Pardon me. You there? Terribly sorry to interrupt, but I'm wondering if you could possibly help me with the most delicate matter. Splendid. You see, there happens to be a young woman who likes to frequent these parts, and although we've only spoken a few words, she looks at me. Now again, I just know we're meant to be together, I know it. The thing is, I'm at Malhorst Gale. She's a buyer choice farmer, and well, I needn't explain to you what would happen if word got out. Still, I can't stop thinking about her. Could you take this note to her? Please! I can't trust anyone else with such a delicate matter. You'll find her at the Ratatoska for it. It's one of the favourite spots. Please, do hurry. I fear my heart can't wait any longer. Why, hello, dear. What's this, you brought a night? For the lonely? I see. He sent you. How very clever. Yes, we were making eyes at each other these past few weeks, but that's about all we can do, I'm afraid. Still, he's such a brave man for having reached out like this. Perhaps I can have you deliver a note in return? And please, do not go back to the bar with this. Find another way to contact him. I'll be at Ontario's if you need me. I can't believe he reached out. It's like a dream come true. Please contact him as soon as possible. Oh, I was hoping to hear from you. And you have a note for me. Go to where our love shall bloom. Oh, well, that's easy. One of the few times we spoke, Dulcinea told me about her secret spot. A garden here in the Arcology. She talked about the flowers. One in particular, the moon blossom. She just loved the way it looked at night, the way it practically glowed in the dark. Do you think you could acquire one for me? It's at the Ralph Horse Garden. Look for the giant statue and you can't miss it. I did remember how I love these, the way their petals glitter in the moonlight. Now, I hate to be the bearer of bad tidings, but I'm afraid your call to Roland wasn't as discreet as we might have hoped. When it comes to MG, they don't tolerate any communication with the enemy. I'm afraid they'll send a kill squad for Roland at any moment. My sources at BioChoice say they're most likely to catch him at the lifts near the Interlink station in the admin zone. Oh, please do hurry. Please hurry. 
I can't stand the thought of them getting to him first. They should be at the interlink station in the admin zone. ready to meet at her place. Wonderful. I'm heading there now. I know. Why don't you join us? Well, just for a moment, of course. But I do want to compensate you for all your efforts. Contractor, I must say, thank you for all your help in putting our good friend Roland out of his miserable, pathetic existence. If it weren't for you, I never would have been able to get him alone into a secure and isolated location. You even managed to stop the MG security team sent to rescue him when they learned of our little plan. From one assassin to another, here's your reward. The money Roland wanted to give you for bringing the two of us together. <laughs> oh, the irony. Unless you'd like to explain our connection to the authorities, who are surely on their way by now, I suggest you destroy this note. And who knows, maybe we'll find ourselves working together again someday soon. I, for one, look forward to it. Poor Roland. Such a perfect example of a primitive organic, don't you think, Flesh? His little head did all the thinking for his big head. And look where it got him. It appears he will not be partaking in the reproductive cycle after all. Just as well. It's probably a good thing Mother Nature won't be passing down that accent. Thank you all for watching my side mission guide for Love Kills, a DLC mission. This one was kind of tricky with a lot of enemies. I hope the video helped. If it did, I would love to hit those like subscribe buttons. And if I saw you again in future videos. But for now, it is time to say bye bye.